long ago, two races ruled over Earth, humans and monsters. One day, war broke out between the two races. After a long battle, the humans were victorious. They sealed the monsters underground with a magic spell. Many years later, Mount Eda 201X. Legends say that those who climb the mountain never return. Just going to make sure it doesn't send us back to that intro, but what's up guys, Rage City Games here, and welcome to episode one. Yes, I said episode one. This is not Rage City Showdown. This is a new series on the channel. This is a game called Undertale. Now, if you have not heard of Undertale, what are you doing with your life? It is a great game. I've only seen a little bit about it, but from what I have seen, it is amazing. It is an RPG in which you don't have to kill anything. And that run is called a pacifist run. You can also do a run based on complete morality in which you can kill some things, but you don't have to kill everything. Or you can do a genocide run in which you kill everything. Now, unfortunately, if you do a genocide run, it completely stains your save file and you can't get the full effect of any other of the runs, which is unfortunate because I wanted to start with a genocide run because everyone starts with a uh, pacifist run. But because, because everything is structured so the game almost forces you to, give, to go for the pacifist run first to get all of the dialogue, we're going to go with the pacifist run. Huh. Question of the day, what do you think of Undertale? I personally love it. Do you think it's overhyped? Do you love it? Or do you like some parts and hate some parts? But enough about that. Let's stop looking at the instruction screen and let's dive into Undertale. Name the fallen human. Yeah, we stupid. We stupid, we stupid. We fell into a freaking hole. We fell into a freaking hole. Oh, wait, no. Crap. ADD. Oh, dang. Wait. Nope. For a second, I thought I could just type it in, but no, that's never that easy. Travis Bruce. Okay, we can't use spaces, so we're just going to call ourselves Rage. I should just say Rage City. Yeah, Rage City. That'll work. Rage Sita. Yeah, never mind. Doesn't work. Rage. There we are. Name of Fallen Human Rage. Sure. Is this name correct? Yes, it is. Oh wow, okay. Thought it was gonna give us a cinematic, but nope. No such thing in Undertale. We don't believe in un in opening cinematics. <laughs> well, let's see. Let's go through here. Oh crap. I've heard about you. Oh Jesus. Howdy, I'm Flowery. Flowery the flower. 
I'm gonna be fitting in with a lot of voices, so bear with me. Hmm. You're new to the underground, aren't you? <laughs> Dolly, you must be so confused. Someone ought to teach you how things work around here. I guess little old me will have to do. Ready? Here we go. See that heart? That is your soul. The very culmination of your being. Yeah, that's it. Why is my heart my soul, heart and soul thing? Oh, yes. Okay. Okay. Oh, I was just going to keep going around in circles until he started talking again. Your soul starts off weak, but you can grow strong to gain a lot of levels. What's... Oh. What's LB stand for? It's not what love, of course. You want some love, don't you? <laughs> don't worry. I'll share some with you. Down here, love is shared through little white friendliness pellets. Are you ready? Move around. Get as many as you can. You idiot. In this world, it's kill or be killed. Why would anyone pass up an opportunity like this? Oh, God in heaven. Die. What the hell? Wait, is it possible to just, like, die? Oh, thank God, little horn thing. What a terrible creature. Torturing such a poor, innocent youth. Come, don't be afraid, my child. I am Toria, caretaker of the ruins. I pass through this place every day to see if anyone has fallen down. You're the first human to come here in a long time. Come, I will guide you through the catacombs. This way. So we're just gonna follow the weird thing with antlers, or horns. Yeah, we did. Yeah, well, we are stupid enough to fall down a hole, so let's do this. Come on, come on, come on. Thank you. Wait, I wanna, I wanna go to the sparkling thing. Come, on. God dang it. Okay, fine. We're following. Welcome to your new home, innocent one. I need to educate you in the operation of the ruins. Yeah, because we dumb as crap. The ruins are full of puzzles. Ancient fusions between diversions, diversion, diversion. I know what a diversion is, I don't know why it's here. Diversions and therapies. I must solve them to move from room to room. Please adjust yourself to the side of them. Oh, okay, yeah, we don't have to redo this part. Sweet. To make progress here, you will need to trigger several switches. Do not worry, I have labeled the ones that you need to feel. Flip off. Okay. Press Z to read signs. Press Z to read signs. Okay. Splendid. I am proud of you, little one. Let us move to the next room. I actually have a timer going this time because I never remember to do that. Uh, during videos, so I know approximately when I have to end. As a human living in the underground, monsters may attack him. Oh, she looks so sad. Do you need to be prepared for this situation? However, worry not. The process is simple. Oh, thank God, I'm an idiot. When you encounter a monster, 
You run into a fight. While you are in a fight, strike up a friendly conversation. Stall for time. I will come to resolve the conflict. Practice talking to the gang. Okay, this is getting real weird real quick. I love it. Just gonna talk to the gun. Yo, what's up, dude? You encounter the gun. Wait. I thought we didn't want to fight it. Hey, okay. Tell me. Let me talk to it. It wouldn't let me talk to it. Uh, do anything but talk to it. Uh, fight it. I freaked out for a second. It doesn't say much for Toriel seems happy with you. You won! You earned zero, zero XP and zero gold. That's not like something you hate to see. Okay. Why does it make me press enter? That's so weird. I thought my game glitched out for a second. Oh, very good. Are right, very good. Because I can talk to the dummy. Yo, what's up, dummy? There was another puzzle in this room. Why do you look sad? Just solve it. I wonder if you can solve it. Okay, thanks. Oh, she isn't it. Uh, Froggit attacks you. Second act. Thank goodness. Froggit. Alright, uh, check. Life is difficult for this. Oh, That's really sad. <laughs> Yo, look at Toriel's eyes. She was like, back up. Back up. You don't want this. You don't want this work. Thank you, dude. Okay. The western room is the eastern room's blueprint. The western room is the eastern room's blueprint. Okay. What the heck? Puzzles seem a little too dangerous for him. I can't, there's even, this isn't even a penalty for running into it. I wanted to see if I'd lose the EXP while on the main map. You have done excellently thus far, my child. I haven't done a dang thing. What the heck? Okay. However, I have a difficult question request to ask of you. Dot dot dot. I would like you to walk to the end of the room by yourself. Okay, so if that's a difficult request, then something at the end of the room is gonna jack us up and blow us back. Forgive me for this. Oh, good God. Oh, good God, the music just got real. Why is the music so real? What the heck? Oh, my God. Is this a never-ending hallway? Oh, Lord. Oh, Lord. Oh, no, come on. Oh, you butt! Greetings, my child. Never. I did not beat you. I was merely behind this pillar the whole time. Thank you for trusting me. However, there was an important reason for this exercise. To test your independence. Well, how you just let a tiny kid after they after he or she, I can't really tell, fell down a hole, probably 
fucking so silly. Oh, God. Just leave him alone to test his independence. Okay. I must attend to some business. And you must stay alone for a while. Please remain here. It's dangerous to explore by yourself. I have an idea. I will give you a cell phone. If you have a need for anything, just call. Be good. All right? Hey, there it is. Oh, right. Oh, it wouldn't let me do that a second ago. I swear it wouldn't let me do that a second ago. Okay. Say hello. About yourself, flirt. Just gonna say hello. Dial. <laughs> Why does it do that? I'm sitting here like, dang, this. What is this? Dial up? We on a cord phone? Some. It's amazing that some people will never see a cord phone in their life. You ever think about that? This is Toriel. Yeah. You want only wanted to say hello? Well. Right. Hello! Click. I hope that suffices. <laughs> Click. Close enough. So. Cool. Oh god, ring. Hello. This is Tori. You, you have not left the room, have you? There are a few puzzles ahead that I have yet to explain. It would be dangerous to try to solve them by yourself. Be good. Alright? Click. Grab it. Grab it. Excuse me, human. I have some advice for you about battling monsters. If you act a certain way or fight until you almost defeat them, they might not want to battle you anymore. If a monster does not want to fight you, please, use some mercy, human. Rub it. Dark Frog. Frog it hop. Close. So. Act. Sure, sure. Life is difficult. Meow. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. You are intimidated by Froggit's raw strength. Only kill. Compliment. Froggit didn't understand what you said, but it was flattering that Let's just be pleased. Yeah, it is. Oh god. You won. You earned zero XP and two gold. Playfully crinkling through the loops for a determination. HP fully restored. Hey, there we are. Save. File save. Full bit. Um, even if this is less than about 20 minutes, this is a good place to save. There we are. Because I started the timer a little bit late, so I don't know exactly where we are. But this has been Rage City Games playing Undertale. This has been episode one. I hope to see you guys next time. See ya.